Hey everybody, this is not a spring chicken. Did you see the VMEs last night? Okay. Well, if you are on the West Coast, let's just say you did see a different show than the East Coast. Now, for those of you that might have seen it, <clears throat> does this mean anything to you? <laughs> anyway, for now, we're going to bring old Camel on with comments on the headlines of today. Where are we down at work? And it's all over for the Republicans. Well, Boehner admitted last night that uh, he's going to... Uh, he, he, he said the President of the United States came to his house and said, I understand that you have a granddaughter. Uh, he said, I'd like her delivered to my, oh, um, actually that's what rumored that Boehner is basically sucking up to the President that much, but he's not. He's just going to be removed from office. Oh my gosh. Yeah. And Obama, the Tea Party, is out to get me because I am black. Oh, I mean, they basically sent out black leaders yesterday to attack Republicans. That the Tea Party is a racist organization. Um, I heard somebody yesterday to Colin Powell, and Colin Powell backed off. He said, "You know, that's the most racist statement that I've heard." You said, "Guy said, tell me one single time when the Tea Party." Well, there's plenty of pictures. He said, "Tell me one time." Well, there's plenty of evidence. Tell me one time, and he said, "Well, I can't specifically. They can't because there is none. They um." Andrew Breitbart offered $100,000 to anyone that could find a racist remark by the Tea Party. They got racist remarks by the left at Tea Party events. And I mean, so there is none because the Tea Party is all about fiscal conservatism and adhering to the laws. Mm -hmm. That's a big difference, folks. And very little doubt chemical weapons used in Syria. Well, like the guy, I think what they said, Assad said this morning, he said, it's our country, and these are people trying to destroy, they're destroying our country, and if they're going to, if they're, you know, we will, we're not signers, of, they aren't signers of the, of the convention. They have, mm -hmm. it's just like the Japanese never signed a Geneva Convention, because the um, Japanese didn't believe in surrender. So if you don't sign something, you don't have to adhere to the rules that other people say you do. Oh! That sounds like press. Yeah. <laughs> and more NSA spying news released. Oh yeah, it seems like the Obama administration was spying on the United Nations now and the people that basically say it's all right. Well, it's done all the time. And uh, I'm gonna, when I do this, I always, when, I, when people say it's done all the time, I always revert back to it. I was playing a German in, in, on, in the Dirty Dozen and uh, Basically, I was there on a set the day Lee Marvin says to Charles Bronson, when Charles Bronson said, yes, but what I did was right. And Lee Marvin says, yes, but you got caught. <laughs> yeah. Uh -oh. that's, that's, if you, you everything, got caught. If you, anything is right if you don't get caught. Like, um, I, I was also on an episode on, on Hawaii Five-0 where McGarrett said that, uh, he, he said, that, you know, he said, there'll never be a perfect crime. They want to know why. He said, because if it's a perfect crime, you never knew it happened. Mm -hmm. That's the whole thing with the NSA. Everybody knows what's going on, and they're all pissed off at Obama about it. Because, oh, oh, Herbie Daddy said, when did all of this start? Right after Obama became president of the United States. The spying stuff increased. Despite one court order after another court order after another court order, he has been, he has been hit with court orders continually to stop doing what he's doing, and he refuses. And House Chairman rejects a special citizenship path. I ain't gonna make any difference because the, the states we're only, another state, another democratic controlled state, New York City, is New York State is getting ready to allow people to be on juries, and since most states take the juries from the voter polls, it means they have to grant citizenship in the states. You can't do it. To, it's, it's forbidden by federal law, but they've decided to take it on their own hand to change federal law. And Tea Party blast lawmakers for fearing town hall Obamacare fight. The Demo Republicans, there's 38 Republicans in Baynard who are going to give Obama everything he wants, including today. They said the Republicans are going to back off on sequester now because stopping the massacres in Syria are too, uh, are too important. Well, let's put it this way. The Republican Party isn't the same people that are supporting Obama in the Republicans' House and Senate are the ones that say it's too important now. So all the cuts are going to go bye-bye because of Syria, which is probably why Obama wants to make it, he wants it to get worse. Oh, speaking about getting worse, you sent me wildfire grows fueling dangerous winds. Yeah, oh, what did Herbie Daddy say? 
He said that um, if it quacks like a duck, it looks like a duck, it has feathers like a duck, we have feet like a duck, and it swims in water, it's probably a duck. And basically since environmentalists want all of the structures in Yosemite out of there and the park closed, oh, guess what's going on? I know. They're, the park is burning so to the sad. ground. And it makes, it's so sad. It's Yosemite is so gorgeous that everybody should be able to enjoy it. Oh, but here's one. Hetch Hetchy. The park, the next, the Hetch Hetchy Valley next door to it was a mirror of Yosemite and got, oh, was it Democrats that destroyed Hetch Hetchy? There's a big dam. Oh, they did? Oh, yeah. Democrats destroyed uh, the mirror image to Yosemite. I didn't, never knew there was a mirror oh, image. Who, who did all the building in Yosemite? Oh, it was Franklin Delano Roosevelt. What was it? Delano Roosevelt. Wasn't he a Democrat? Yeah, he was a Democrat. Who built all the roads in Yosemite? Oh, it was Franklin Delano Roosevelt. I'm just like sitting yeah. sick to my stomach. They're going to burn it to the ground. They're going to save the, the most important trees and stuff in the valley and then let everything else just fry. I, I, I'm just disgusted. It's just um, what happens when you have Democrats in charge. It's and, just their purpose. And Boehner to cave into Obama demands yet again. Yeah. Said I that, don't know when Boehner ever caved into Obama. He, 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 basically, every time Obama wants something, he gives him and McConnell, they get absolutely nothing in return. Do they get budget cuts? No. Do they get anything in return from Obama for caving in? No. Well, oh, but oh, they do. But Baynard and McConnell want love from the Democrats and the press. Oh. And they don't give a rat's ass what the Republicans want. They just want to be loved by the press and Democrats. And government seeks new limits on silica dust. Ah, yeah. Okay. Silica dust? Yeah, you know, the stuff you make glass with, the stuff you make paint mm -hmm. with, the stuff you make stucco with, the stuff you build with. They want to restrict it now so it becomes too cost prohibitive to do anything in the modern world. Isn't that amazing mm -hmm. thing? It's, it's uh, the Democrats and the environmentalists at work again. And Senator Alexander is the latest Republican to face primary challenge. Uh, everybody that's voting to support Obama is going to get their rear ends kicked out. They said, well, the Republican, the Tea Party is going to destroy the Republican Party. No. Uh, here's a trick is, if you win every single state that the Republicans are running, you win the presidency. But if you tell the Republicans in no state to go to hell, you don't win the presidency. Elections are local. They're not national. All elections are local. And Mexico's looming oil battle bid to bring in foreign investment sparks protests. Oh, yeah. You know why? My mommy and my, my, mommy and my daddy and my grandparents had oil interest in Mexico that was taken from them by the Mexican government not once but three times. And I can guarantee you, when the Mexican government, I've already been contacted about it, when the Mexican government decides to go with all these other petroleum companies, we're going to sue the hell out of them mm -hmm. to get back. And it's and what is it? I want one of the people said, and my 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 share alone is like three billion bucks. What? Yeah, we're going to sue them. Oh. I want my money and my it, my mother, my grandparents owned oil fields in Mexico, and they were seized from them. What? Yeah. Ooh. And then my grandparents gave them to my father and my mother. And it's all mine since they're dead now. And I will sue them, folks. Three billion is a, even at my age, a lot of fun money. Yeah. And IRS also targeted liberals and Democrats say, uh, but can't provide any proof it was done in large numbers. They, get, they got seven liberal organizations. Oh, what were they? Uh, it said Spirit of 76 Patriot Broadcasting. Things that they, they, oh, we made a mistake. And they gave them, as soon as they discovered they were Democrats, they give them, from, they give them what they wanted immediately. Are you serious? Yeah. And Qaeda head slammed Saudi support to Egypt. Yeah, uh, that's, that's the Democrats. Well, you're supporting, they, okay, it is not legal for the Muslim Brotherhood to hold office in any Muslim country. And the Obama administration cannot get it through their heads that it is illegal. And you put them in. He said, well, in the United States, well, so they told me I can't be president. Well, that was 50 years ago, and I'm still president. <laughs> and a Monty bubbleism from the Mark Twain of the animal kingdom. Okay. And I'll never say the one I'm supposed to say, so I'll make that. Herbie Daddy said to say simply that, that anything that you see that isn't, bought, isn't removed from television was meant to be that way or would have never been seen.